couple of filmmakers on a mission to showcase the incredible beauty of our natural world. We're filming some extraordinary things. Traditionally, we produce documentaries for big organisations like Nat Geo, like Discovery Channel. From the ocean's super predators to the world's rarest marsupial and everything in between. Subscribe to our channel for regular videos featuring our latest adventures and the unique animals we're currently focused on. Perfectly normal behaviour. Our filmmaking journey began back in the 90s. We grew up on the south coast of Western Australia and a mutual passion for diving amongst the pristine waters of the Recherche Archipelago drew us together and started a lifelong passion for filming and exploring the places that haven't been tamed by man. We were contracted by a big broadcaster to film tiger sharks and all their prey along the magical west coast and learnt so much about how an ecosystem works, how everything is interconnected and if the delicate balance of life is damaged, everything else suffers. We've travelled far and wide in pursuit of opportunities to film creatures great and small and had some mind-blowing encounters with wild animals. Then, a life-changing event happened. Back in 2003, I heard of a sperm whale stranding. It's about 400 kilometres behind me in that direction. We took across our camera gear to have a look at this location, and what we saw was just incredible. I wasn't ready for it at all. Nine sperm whales on the beach, getting warm in the midday sun, and exploding with calves flying out of them, blood and guts and intestines hitting the water. It was the most unbelievable thing I've seen. And within about 12 hours, the great white started turning up. We filmed many sharks over the ensuing days as the whale carcasses decomposed, and a really angry one attacked our boat. Needless to say, we became a bit more careful about when and how we entered the water after that. just come back from Port Lincoln in South Australia and while we were over there we ran into one of the most remarkable animals I've ever seen. A female great white. She was around four and a half metres in length and extremely inquisitive and of course great whites don't have hands so she was researching the area in the only way she knows how and that's with her mouth.
But it's not all gnashing teeth and apex predators we train our lenses on. Much of the time we work alongside scientists who have research permits and are qualified to handle Australia's native animals. It's a great way for us to document these gorgeous creatures that most people would otherwise never get to see. And we see how our footage has the power to foster a deeper understanding and appreciation of nature. Wow. So please, Subscribe and share to help build a community of like-minded people keen to preserve our natural heritage. We're usually in some really remote areas of Australia filming really rare animals. What we need to do is bring you guys along with us. We've got some great things in the pipeline, some really exciting stuff, so make sure you keep up to speed with what we're doing and connect on Facebook and Instagram. Yeah. That's so <laughs> pathetic. <laughs>